Yo, hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. Enhance payment processing for your Shopify store in 2023 by connecting Razorpay. This tutorial will show you how to integrate Razorpay with Shopify, allowing you to accept payments efficiently and securely. So let's get it started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So guys, obviously what you need to do is to have a Razorpay account and to have a Shopify store. So by clicking on Shopify.com, click on login and log in to your account. And since now we are on this dashboard, before we even do anything, make sure that Razorpay is actually accepted on Shopify. How to do so, you can either go to the Q&A a page of Shopify so here we go and search if uh, Razor pay is accepted as you can see and now Razor pay secure now appears as a payment getaway on your Shopify store checkout all right that means that Razor pay is actually acceptable by Shopify now before you even get too excited and go fast to your settings and just adjust the settings and find, try, try to find it. Make sure that Razor Pay is, is accepted in your country. So uh, let's countries that something like that. And currently, Razor Pay supports only India and India rupees. Note only the organizations with India has as their country will be able to set up Razor Pay as their payment getaway. So here, if I went to my store, if I try to find it as an app, first of all, if I went here to the Shopify App Store and I clicked into this button, so let me just do that, and I go to this marketplace and I searched for Razor Pay. As you can see, there will be nothing as uh, the app that will help me actually add the payments. There is this one, but it is only as a widget. It is not as a payment getaway for your website. You might find it as a widget, you might um, uh, add it to your website, but it will not be functional since the money is not even being sent to your account in Razor Pay. They will be wasted. So that's why go first to your settings, which are located in the bottom of the page in the corner left and then go to the payments over here as you can see in this section then here click to choose a provider and you will find this long list full of stuff so here they are alphabetically uh, or in an order of alphabet so yeah this this is R and there is nothing that says Roger Pay between Q and S and R. So that means in the country that my store is available at the moment, which is Pakistan, it will not be working. So what should we do is to turn it into India. So let's do that real quick. Choose India. And here we have to fill these informations as well. So let's try to find India fake address. Fake address generator India. And now just copy this. Go to your Shopify, put it as an address, and here copy the state or the city. The state should be Andhra Pradesh, something like that. So Andhra Pradesh. And for the zip code, this is this one. So let's do that. And click on save. There's two arrows. Let me just Move this and paste it. And there we go. So now we have changed it. And of course, we have to change this as well. So we have to search for Indian rupees. So let me just type on I, Indian rupees, save. And there you have it. So here, I'm just going to my payments. And already you have seen something that has appeared which is PayPal. Click on choose a provider. And here, all you need to do 
is go all the way down here in the bottom of the page and try to find the app that you were looking for. So it is as simple as that, guys. If you didn't find it here, you can search for it from here. And if you did still have um, any problem with your account creation or anything, make sure to just come here to the section and ask uh, the assistant for anything. Is Razor, for example, be available for my store? And as you can see now, just choose your store, choose your account. Let's go. Uh, it's into the resources. So, yes, there's a page available for your Shopify store if it's supported in your country. Check Shopify's list of payment getaways by country. Click here to confirm. So, click. And then here you will have a payment request FAQ that you will be interested in if you didn't actually find Razor Pay in your payments getaways or your providers so here we are offering limited number of merchants the opportunity to test new checkout flow in the form of an a slash b experiment so what they're basically saying uh, is basically not everyone has the possibility to actually have every getaway. You really have to get a premium account or either be a very old Shopify user to actually get the access to the full getaways that they have in their library. And what does it mean is since for me, for example, I have a new account, stuff like Razorpay are not going to be totally available for me. But as I showed you guys, if you do have an old store and you are paying for the premium version, you will not have this problem as I am facing right now. The problem is that my store has just changed its address at the moment. As you can see this video, I am on the free trial plan. So my store isn't even a week old and I am not uh, really uh, using my store as totally I should use it. Example, I didn't even finish this 10, ten steps because it is just a free trial, so I don't really have to finish them. And I won't be able to finish them since I have to finally pick a plan and buy something from them. So that is why I had this problem. But overall, after you get your Razor Pay downloaded and accepted, so then, so then just you have to do is to install this Razor Pay affordability widget so you can have people have it as uh, a payment getaway for them as well. So like that, they will be paying you by Razor Pay and you will be receiving money in your Razor Pay account. And yeah guys, that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you guys a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial. Bye bye.